morning. <laughs> Good morning. I wanted to film a way in a week, week in my life. I'm like going to the gym and stuff, just like my new fitness life. But I'm still not feeling very well, so I didn't go to the gym today. I'm gonna take a COVID test. I don't think I've got COVID, but just in case, I don't wanna go to work if I've got COVID, so. I'm gonna do a test now. Oh, <laughs> I really hate doing this. I'm kind of scared to do it in this nostril because I had a nosebleed yesterday. <laughs> and I really don't want another one, but I prefer the test. Here's Siri. So that's that 30 second timer. I'm actually doing the test in the hallway because I don't want the shower to, I don't know, affect the test somehow. It looks like it's gonna be negative, so I'm gonna get ready for work. I think I'm just ill. It's not like COVID ill. It doesn't feel like when I have COVID, but I thought I would just check. I'm like running late now because I did that COVID dust, <laughs> which is negative by the way, which is good. Here's my outfit of the day. Can't really see it, but it's like, <laughs> wait. And it's raining, so I'm gonna wear my Dot Martens. Yeah, so I'm kind of running late, but when I say running late, I just mean I'm gonna miss my favorite train, <laughs> which is the train that goes directly from my, like train station by my house to the train station that's on my work. Really, I can start any time between eight and nine, probably even earlier than eight, but who started work before eight. Sandwich, a Huel for breakfast. I'm gonna drink this now. To take as a snack. Basically, my challenge for this week is to not buy anything from the shop. I really can't be bothered, but I'm gonna make lunch for tomorrow. I want a meal prep this week. I think I already mentioned it, but I'm trying not to buy anything. So I'm gonna make some tofu noodle salad for lunch tomorrow and Wednesday. I really just forgot what day it is. <laughs> and it's almost nine o'clock, so I'm not doing this at the best time. I've been putting it off and now I'm doing it. I was like, stop just do it and I've also decided that I'm not gonna go to the gym tomorrow because I'm feeling way better actually but I don't want to make myself worse by going to the gym so I'm not gonna go tomorrow but I'll go back on Wednesday because tomorrow is a spin day anyway and I think spin will actually destroy me like I don't know I can't breathe <laughs> Chocolate banoffee, dark chocolate brownie, chocolate caramel. Brown. My 
lunch is looking pretty dry, so Leo suggested sweet chili sauce. <laughs> is it gonna be too spicy? I don't know, it's like an eternal question. I feel like I need a um, peanutty kind of flavor. I should have made one, but I haven't, so I'm gonna try and buy a sauce now. Okay, I'm just making my lunch. It's actually half past nine. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't make two lunches yesterday, but I'm making another lunch today. It's basically the same lunch. It was pretty delicious. So I'm gonna make it again. I might make a peanut sauce for it. And then I need to get ready and get my stuff ready because I'm gonna go to the gym tomorrow. I'm feeling quite a lot better. I'm still coughing a little bit, which is not fun. I'm kind of excited to go back to the gym because I feel like it's been a long time. better at prepping for the next day. I'm packing my bag now and I could just never be bothered when I get home. I can't even be bothered to make my lunch properly, like I'm not using a chopping board. I booked a spin class in the morning, so that should be fun. Just getting ready for bed, getting ready for tomorrow. I don't know, I don't have much to say. I feel like I'm not updating much, but at the same time, I'm not doing much. I'm literally working, watching TV. That's it. Also, I cut my hair. <laughs>
Like I feel like you would think that going to the gym at 6 a.m. would be really tiring and like I'd be really tired but I'm on my way to work and I feel so much better for going to the gym. It's crazy. It like makes me feel so much more energized. I'm out of breath though. <laughs> morning it's finally finally saturday i feel like this has been the longest week ever <laughs> i just want to say hi because i feel like i've not been talking to the camera much i just just been tired but i'm filming all my food which was kind of my main goal for this week another main goal was not buying lunch and i didn't buy lunch once during the work week which was really really good um quite proud of myself for that because tesco man it's too close to my work <laughs> it's so easy i did buy one snack i think from tesco i got some cookies that might be it i can't remember um but you would have seen <laughs> anyway so yeah no plans i'm just having breakfast now i made toast i've got one jam one chocolate spread and two of chocolate spread and jam i think that's right if you haven't tried like strawberries and chocolate together it works really well <laughs> it's not exactly the same effect when it's jam and chocolate spread but you know the flavors are still the same it's still kind of similar I have been having Huel like during the week, but then when I've got time on the weekends, sometimes I'll make something different. Like today I did something different, but my main issue is like, I'm gonna be hungry really soon after. Like I have learned that the Huel actually keeps me full for way, way longer than like any breakfast food. I think because I like sweet stuff, maybe if I like savory foods, it'd be better. Inside. Be over my troubles. Yeah, they've been there for so long now. Ooh, Cause suddenly I think of tomorrow. Yeah, since you came, came around. Ooh, I feel like the only one who found out the reason why. I've dictated the day and we've come out for lunch. Never been here before, but it sounds nice. And then we're gonna get an English breakfast. I 
don't really use our coffee machine much because I work from the office like all week. So I'm going to make a coffee, but I've not learned how to steam the milk yet. So wish me luck. <laughs> So that was a lesson on how probably not to froth milk. <laughs> I put it in the glass to see what it was like, but it's really hot. So that's good, I guess, but it's hot. Hopefully it tastes nice. <laughs> I need to figure out how to clean this thing now. Honestly, don't have a clue what I'm doing. Yay. <laughs> I forgot to do my waitress haul, but I'll show you stuff as we go. <laughs> but right now, we're having coffee and a cake. A cheesecake. Milkshake sounds so good. <laughs> I haven't spoken today. I don't think I have at all. I'm just making dinner now. We went to pick up our pottery, which I did three weeks ago, I think. My mum came to visit. We went to like a paint your own pottery class. So we picked up this spoon holder and I also made a bowl. Wait, I'll show you. This is the bowl. And my mum made a mug and it was really fun, but we didn't really need the stuff to do it. And yeah, we got burgers for lunch. And like my thing I'm trying to do really is like two meals that aren't really cooked at home. So have Monday pizza night and then one thing on the weekend or like we go out for lunch then we get like coffee and cake somewhere so we can still like go out to eat. It's one of my favorite things to do. <laughs> um, but because we had the brunch, we feel like the brunch wasn't that like bad or unhealthy. <laughs> so we went out for burgers today, which was good because I was really craving burgers and chips it was really quite expensive place we went to it was nice it's actually really good yeah so we went we had burgers and i literally have done nothing all day so i'm making dinner we're making like a curry sweet potato butternut squash tofu curry easy meal with like microwave rice because i just 
some days you want to cook like a whole thing some days you don't i'm drinking a green tea because i've got a sore throat which is great because i'm barely even over my current cold or well, the cold i had at the beginning of the week and now i'm getting a sore throat so am i getting another cold is it just a one day thing i guess we'll find out i'm also using my new non-stick pan which i got from Danelm, I think, and it's really good. All of our pots and pans are like scratched. We've been using metal utensils for ever. And now we've got these silicone ones, so I'm trying really hard not to use a spatula or anything on this pan, and it's really good. Nothing sticks to it, as a non-stick pan should. <laughs> so that's it really, making dinner, and then I need to get all my stuff ready for next week. I've already booked my spin class for Tuesday because you can book stuff two days before. Um, which I always have to try and remember. And that's it. End of the week. I, I've been thinking about you. Cool. I'm gonna head to bed. I wanted to say thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really like watching weekly vlogs, so I hope you have enjoyed watching it too. Subscribe if you're new. Give me a like if you did enjoy this video. And I'll see you very soon for another one. Okay. Bye.